Alright, so, I'm on this guy's video, and I'm seeing all these comments of people saying, Need help when I press, need help when I press, we know, you know, well, trust me, I know, trust me, I know, trust me, I know. I sat here for two days straight trying to figure this out. Now, I'm going to show you guys right now, you go right here to manualaudicityteam.org, you know, and literally, it has the entire, you know, I was like, okay, cool, you know, let's go look down at this, let's look at, oh, look right here. Clicking record or using the R shortcut always begins recording at the end of the currently selected tracks. I'm like, okay, so what, what? Oh, the alternative record new track action for record button is activated by holding shift while recording. Well, look at that, people. Now, you take your track. See, I started recording. Now, look, this is going at the end. Oh, at the end. Oh, oh, at the end. Okay, so, yeah. See, now watch Start right here. This is going at the end. Oh, at the end. Oh, oh, at the end. Okay. See so now you not yeah. Now, see. Now you press this, the shift button, and look at that. We got a whole new track list going on right now. See? Watch. We can do it like this. We'll actually completely redo this so you guys can actually see close it now nah, I don't want to save this project all right let's open a new project we'll go to uh, you know whatever file you guys want to use I'm gonna use this one right here like everybody does found this vocal stripper doesn't really work well in this thing but hey you know whatever so now watch press shift it's starting to go So it still works, is the point. You're welcome, guys.